A few kilometers towards the north of Shantaniketan flows Kopai River. It is not at all mighty or famous, but is simple and beautiful. In his twenties, Gobindanath Tagore was mesmerized by the mighty Padma in Bangladesh. However, while saying about Kopai, he says that unlike Padma, it is much more simple and beautiful, like a household girl. Kopai is a river which flows in a rhythm. is not at all harmful and never floods it is very narrow and can be crossed on foot on several places this narrow stream originates in jamtara district of jharkhand at khajuri village sal river is its name at the place of origination the name kopai starts when it passes the village vinuria in birbhum this name was given by rabindranath tagore himself in the village hasuli bag near lapur it flows and mixes with the bokkeshwar river the only clusters of greeneries in birbhum were the tribal villages even today they are the protectors of the river and the ecosystem around people of birbhum hold them in high regards as we all should kopai is a household name around the villages of konkalitala bollopur mohistal etc this seasonal river was said to have huge water inflow during the rainy season that seems to have decreased a lot owing to the several distributaries dug out of it in order to support irrigation the river is dotted with several towering chimneys they are the brick manufacturing sites which use the clay of the river Kopai is also sacred in a sense that it has many places of cremation in its banks. The village of Mohistal have yielded chalcolithic artifacts which take the history of Kopai to more than 2000 years back. Today this river is prone to erosion because of extensive sand mining the scenic beauty of this simple river has converted its banks into picnic spots which is refreshing and also polluting at the same time despite being a narrow line of water this river has our utmost respect for being a natural family member